vlog is going to be on what's it like working with your spouse. I like this one. This is unsolicited footage. He didn't even know it was coming at him. So what is it like? What is it like for you to work with someone like me? What is it like? It's uh it's exciting. full of energy. There's energetic conversations that happen. That's a, that's a nice word. Drama? Drama? Sometimes. Not that yeah. much. I don't want to deal with drama. What do you think it's, um, what is it like to always be with me all day, every day? All day, every day? Mm -hmm. I think it's fun to hang out. Yeah. Do you really think it's a challenge for people to work with their spouse? get along. Sometimes everyone needs their space or something here or there. Right? So, Do you need your space for me sometimes? No, no. Yeah, everybody needs a little bit of space, right? Yeah, I so, need my space for me. Sometimes. You need some space. I do. Sometimes it's I It's healthy. Need. Yeah. It's healthy. Yeah. So, but, yeah, we get along pretty good. Yin and yang. Yeah. I'm pretty easy going, so that makes things, you know, normal. Am I easy going? Be honest. This is raw Are and you real. Easy going? Yeah. Am I easy going? Yeah. Yes, but not as much as me. <laughs> I think sometimes I can be a pain in the butt. I'll throw myself into the bus. Some days. Yeah. It's it's all a matter of perspective. Depends on what's going on. When 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 things start going sideways multiple times. Yeah. You know, all at once, I guess. That's that's a challenge. Yeah. Uh, I think the other thing, would you say that it's, um, our work is always with us. Yeah. We work together. So I think that that can be, um, like, even when we're at dinner, we're like, okay, we're not going to talk about work. Yeah, that kind of doesn't happen, really, but yeah. moments. Yeah. But when you love what you do, yeah. and then it you love what easy. you do it with. That's right. It makes it all easy. Yeah. yeah. Here at our office. We use Barbie dolls. I call them therapy dolls. So we usually use them as a listing agent talking to a buyer agent. <laughs> right now we're gonna use it for my and Todd's marriage since we work together all day and most of the day he ignores me. So, hey Todd, how are you? I'm good, Colleen, how are you? How come you always ignore me? Is it because I never shut up? Todd? <laughs> what's, um, what's your favorite part about working with me? Working with your spouse? Um, Let's turn around. Favorite? Yeah, what's your favorite? <sighs> well, let's see. It's it's fun because we can go do stuff, you know. Mm -hmm. It'd be efficient. We can get stuff done. We can talk immediately about something. Mm -hmm. We can brainstorm, like bounce things off each other real fast. Make quick decisions. What do you think about when I ask you um, about a marketing idea? Um, what <laughs> <laughs> marketing? What's that? Right. Uh, yeah. I, I am the opposite. Part. That's when we probably go into a, a slight argument around yeah, it. I'm asking right. your opinion and you're yeah. like, huh. Yeah. I, if I have one, I'll give it to you. Otherwise, I'm probably indifferent yeah. to it. Because most of your ideas are something I logically wouldn't think of normally. Because I don't have a marketing brain. I like an yeah. engineering and operations brain. What advice could you give to people who work with their spouse? Patience. <laughs> Lots of patience. So when you are thinking about working with your spouse, a couple tips um, that I think are important. Um, you can take what's called an Enneagram test. I'm gonna link, hopefully right in here, the link to take a free test. Um, I think, you know, just both sit down and um, take that test to really determine 
uh, your personality type and that will help you figure out your role in the organization when you're working together and more importantly how to um, communicate with each other. Um, of course, I always think it's important to be kind and um, to communicate with each other. That would be another tip. Um, just make sure that you're always um, communicating. I would say I probably over communicate um, when I'm upset uh, or if someone's ignoring me. I communicate that. So that's important. And uh, number four, most importantly, um, remember that your relationship comes first before work. Um, remember to always date and to take time out for each other. Definitely um, take that test and I think even if you're um, you know, working even with a friend, this would be a great test for you to take so that you can decide um, and, and learn from each other's personalities. Look who's with us. It's Lola! Yay! You smile? Yeah, she's super happy. Okay, look at this cool thing we have that we ordered that I absolutely love. Look at that! So it's a really cool car magnet. You do that, and then boom! The boat sits there. Ah, oh, love it! 